Hi, I'm currently at RevSpace, a uh, Dutch hackerspace in The Hague. And in front of me there's my laptop, a Raspberry Pi and four Arduinos. Um, what I made is a, a cluster of res uh, Arduinos that calculate a Mandelbrot fractal where the Raspberry Pi is the, the server which tells the Arduinos uh, what they should do. Uh, the scheduler so to say and the Arduinos do the hard uh, ma mathematics of calculating each pixel. Uh, how it works is that uh, every Arduino gets a request for 32 times 32 pixels. It starts to uh, calculate them and then once in a while the Raspberry Pi asks each Arduino if it's finished. Then uh, it's wrong. It simply is that. It took me uh, Longer than expected because uh, I squared C is not that trivial as I expected. Uh, I had to add sleeps and all kinds of stuff to uh, make sure it didn't uh, return garbage. Uh, but then it was just a matter of uh, uh, implementing a scheduler and uh, drawing things to an SDL service. Um, the result is, I find it rather nice, uh, there's still room for improvement, so, uh, but here's the first version. Uh, here you, say, you see a window being opened and the fractal being drawn. On the back there's a, uh, you see uh, the commands that are sent to each Arduino uh, passing by. If you look at the LEDs, uh, it looks like uh, every Arduino is calculating serially, not parallel. Uh, but that's because in the beginning uh, the calculation is so short that it takes longer to reschedule and communicate all parameters than it is to, uh, well, uh, to calculate. Um, at this point, uh, iterations go up, and here you see that occasionally. Uh, all Arduinos are calculating, that's when the letters lit up, and uh, then it takes a bit longer for them to dim, and well, things start to run in parallel. Also on the background, um, there is each time uh, at the wait for idle, uh, four values, and they tell what, uh, how many work units each uh, Arduino has done. Uh, and initially they they go up evenly and after a while, well, you see, for example at this point that uh, there are, are differences. Um, uh, here you see, for example, that is is already drawing uh, in the next line where there still blocks were black and then after a while they are filled. Um, well, that's about it. If you go to vanheusden.com slash Arduino, uh, well, where you see this video probably, uh, then you can download the, the, the files, uh, the, the Arduino scripts and the, and the Raspberry Pi source code to, uh, to enhance it and play further. A further enhancement could be, for example, that you don't, that you don't simply uh, uh, send a command and wait for a response for each Arduino, but just send the commands and then wait later on if the Arduino responded, because it might take a couple of milliseconds and in that time another Arduino might have uh, responded with a result already. If you're ever in uh, the Netherlands, in The Hague, Please visit Revelation Space in the Haag, in the Hague, well, in Spoorlaan 5, it's called, here the street address. And uh, there's a lot of toys and goodies to play around with, friendly people. And uh, that's about it.